Hi friends, it's me, Mrs. Nicholas here with another story. Did you guys know that May 3rd through May 7th is Teacher Appreciation Week? Well, it is. I bet you guys know a few teachers. Why don't you look around your room and give them a wave? Today, we're going to read to Teacher from the Black Lagoon. Let's take a look. It's the first day of school. I wonder who my teacher is. I hear Mr. Smith has dandruff and warts, and Mrs. Jones has a whip and a wig. But Mrs. Green is supposed to be a real monster. Oh my, I have her. Mrs. Green, room 109. What a bummer. I sit at my desk. I fold my hands. I close my eyes. I'm too young to die. Suddenly, a shadow covers the door. It opens. In slithers Mrs. Green. She's really green. She has a tail. She scratches her name on the blackboard with her claws. Freddie Jones throws a spitball. She curls her lip and breathes fire at him. Freddie's gone. There's just a little pile of ashes on his desk. Talk about bad breath, giggles Eric Porter. She slithers over, unscrews his head, and puts it on the globe stand. I bet she gives homework the first day of school. Your homework for today, grins Mrs. Green, smoke rising from her nostrils, is pages 1 to 200 in your math book. All the fraction problems. We've never had fractions, shouts Derek Bloom. Come over here, she beckons with her claw. Derek stands by her desk. This is a whole boy, she smirks. She takes a big bite. This is half a boy. Now you've had your fractions. Doris Foodie cracks her gum. Mrs. Green swallows her in one gulp. No chewing in class, she smiles. Mr. Bender, the principal, sticks his head in. Keep up the good work. He nods and closes the door. I wish I could get sent to the principal's office. Let's call the roll, cackles Mrs. Green. Freddie Jones is absent. Derek Bloom is half here. Eric Porter is here and there. Doris Foodie is digesting. What about spelling, shouts Randy Potts. Spelling can be fun, beams Mrs. Green, wiggling her fingers at him. Abracadabra kazam! That's tough to spell, says Randy. Suddenly, there's a flash of light, a puff of smoke, and Randy's a frog. Penny Weber raises her hand. Can I go to the nurse, she whines. What's wrong, asks Mrs. Green. I have a huge headache, says Penny. Mrs. Green wriggles her fingers. Then there's another flash of light, and Penny's head is the size of a pin. Better, asks Mrs. Green. Now it's nap time. Everyone who still has one, put your head on your desk. I hope I make it to recess. Sweet dreams, she cackles as I close my eyes. Suddenly, the bell rings. I wake up. There's a pretty woman writing her name on the blackboard. She has real skin and no tail. I'm Mrs. Green, your teacher, she smiles. I jump out of my chair, run up, and hug her. Well, thank you, she says. I'm glad to be here. Not as glad as I am. That's the end of our story, friends. Thanks for joining me. I'm glad we don't have any dragon teachers in our schools. Why don't you take a look at your teacher and say, thank you for teaching me this year. Thanks for joining me, friends. Have a great day.